The Kratos XQ-58 Valkyrie is an experimental stealthy unmanned combat aerial vehicle, UCAV, designed and built by Kratos Defense and Security Solutions for the United States Air Force's low-cost attributable strike demonstrator, LCASD, program under the USAF Research Laboratory's low-cost attributable aircraft technology, LCAAT, project portfolio. It was initially designated the XQ-222. The Valkyrie completed its first flight on 5 March 2019 at Yuma Proving Ground, Arizona. The XQ-58 Valkyrie falls within the USAF Research Laboratory's low-cost attributable aircraft technology, LCAAT, portfolio, whose objectives include designing and building unmanned combat aerial vehicles, UCAVs, faster by developing better design tools and maturing and using commercial manufacturing processes to reduce production time and cost. The LCAAT is to escort the F-22 or F-35 during combat missions and to deploy weapons or surveillance systems. The XQ-58 is designed to act as a loyal wingman that is controlled by a parent aircraft to accomplish tasks such as scouting, defensive fire, or absorbing enemy fire. It features stealth technology with a trapezoidal fuselage with a chined edge, V-tail, and an S-shaped air intake. The XQ-58 can operate as part of a swarm of drones, with or without direct pilot control. The XQ-58 can make conventional takeoffs and landings or be launched from nondescript launch modules, such as support ships, shipping containers, and semi-trailer trucks. The XQ-58 Valkyrie features a clean sheet design. The stealthy design makes the UAV a difficult target to detect and track. The long-range strike aircraft incorporates commercial off-the-shelf CVTS components. It employs manual or pre-programmed flight control systems, ensuring high maneuverability during missions. The UAV has a length of 9.14 meters and a wingspan of 8.2 meters. The dry weight of the aircraft is 1,134 kilograms, while its maximum takeoff weight, MTOW, is 2,722 kilograms. The XQ-58 Valkyrie can carry a maximum payload of 544 kilograms. The open mission system architecture allows it to integrate customer-specific payloads according to the mission requirements. The XQ-58 delivers a combination of long-range, high-speed, and maneuverability, along with the capability to deliver a mix of lethal weapons from its internal bomb bay and wing stations. The internal weapons bay can also accommodate and deliver at least two DBU-39 small-diameter bombs. The XQ-58 Valkyrie is powered by a turbofan engine capable of developing a maximum thrust of approximately 2,000 pounds. The UAV requires no runway facilities to take off and landing, as it uses rocket-assisted launch and parachute recovery systems. Its compact dimensions and small logistical footprint further enable operations from remote and confined locations. The unmanned combat aerial vehicle can fly at a cruise speed of max 0.72, it can operate at altitudes ranging between 50 feet and 45,000 feet and attain a maximum range of 5,556 kilometers, 3,000 nim. <laughs> the XQ-58's first flight took place on 5 March 2019, about two and a half years after Kratos received the contract. A total of five test flights were planned in two phases to evaluate system functionality aerodynamic performance, and launch and recovery systems. On 26 March 2021, the XQ-58A completed its sixth test flight, opening the doors of its internal weapons bay for the first time and releasing a 27 pounds, 12 kilograms, area, I Altius 600 Small Unmanned Aircraft System, U.S. In August 2023, a report with pictures showed the XQ-58A in formation with an F-15E Strike Eagle, from the 96th Test Wing's 40th Flight Test Squadron at Eglin Air Force Base, Florida.